What's going on, Los Entrepreneurs? Welcome back to another video. So, wasn't gonna make a video this week, honestly. Having a uh, at home, I guess, life issues, you can say. And I don't know. Kind of got down back into a spiral depression, and it came just because my uh, have two dogs. One dog got misdiagnosed twice, and she ended up being semi paralyzed from the waist down. And we're going through treatments right now to try and get her back. And it kind of was a shock and hit me out of nowhere when I was in such a positive attitude. And for me, that's my family. So seeing that happen and not knowing or not being aware and all my focus basically shift to her. So I'm squeezing in this little bit of time to try and make this video. I'm on my way to uh, go home and we're gonna see, we're gonna try and make a uh, little t-shirt. I got a 2X from Walmart, little Fruit of the Loom, and it has a little uh, little chest pouch that you could put pens in and I ain't never tried that before. So we're gonna go ahead and try that and see how that goes. If you guys like what I'm doing, subscribe, like, keep on watching. Oh, before I forget, shout out to the squad, for real. Also, Mike T's, 12 Gone Apparel, especially Marcel this way. Such a nice person, such a nice group. You guys need to join. I'm telling you, don't try and sell anything there. We're just helping each other build. That's what it is. They helped me so much since I've been there, and not even as a uh, YouTube only, just as a person. They, they really connect with you in a different way. And all things styles, you dig designs, shout out to y'all too, because I definitely mess with y'all. So let's get into this video, and we're going to see how it goes right after this intro. Let's go. Hey, ride with me if you ride with me, you can slide with me if you feel like 550 on the five sticky, you can get high with me, that's a deal, right? All right, guys, just got home. About to make this right here. We're gonna head, go ahead and put that through the machine. Hit this mirror option right here. And just go ahead and hit continue. We're gonna be printing this on Cricut vinyl. Got from Walmart, got some scrap left over. And we're gonna see how this goes. Like I said, we're pressing on a Walmart t shirt. Not expecting anything great out of this, just trying it out for the first time. Don't need to change anything else, just gotta hit C and go. Try to put in a little tape, but it ain't seem to hold it. But it should be alright. Gotta go in a red vinyl, come over to the machine, and we'll get this heated up and started. Get this camera a little set up for you guys. There we go. Little fruit to loom. Got the little pocket I was telling you guys about. Peel that off. Take off the tags. That tape ain't holding. We're gonna get this aligned. Since we're only doing the pocket, I'm only gonna have the pocket over. And we're gonna make it as flat as we can. Also get a limp brush. Make sure you always have a limp brush. Don't be trying to lint your clothes. Or don't be trying to press your clothes with lint on them, especially when you get into sublimation. Because once you get into sublimation, your uh, your white tees will start getting blue lint spots all over it. And I see a lot of people on Facebook not knowing uh, 
not knowing uh, that's the problem with it. So we're just going to lint roll this, even though I'm not doing the whole area. Or that area, I'm going to do this whole thing right here. Brand new shirt, got some lint on. Design's about 73% done. Once this is done, I'll come right back to the video, guys. There it is, guys. We did it all out. You can kind of see, I think I got my pressure too high on my weeder because it's kind of scraping through the, uh, scraping through that little plastic. I might have to turn it down a little bit, but this is a real small weeding design. And yeah, it didn't come out too bad. This is the Cricut vinyl. Like I said before, I don't really recommend this for business wise. I'm just using it for this video. This is good practice. The uh, vinyl, Cricut isn't easier, easiest to weed. So if you wanna get something easier, I have tried a uh, Sister Easy Weed and that's way easier. Uh, Jerome from All Things Styles actually re recommended B Flex 5 or Gimme 5, something like that. But that's supposed to be like a five second press. I'm gonna try that soon. See how crazy that thing is, what he's talking about. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and press this, pre-press this shirt. I guess this design on there. Now I'm not using any uh, heat transfer tape. We're just gonna sit there, lay it on there. I'm gonna put it right on this pocket. Never did this before. Uh, don't know how I want it aligned. Guess I'll put it dead in the center. Got it right there, lay it down. Yeah, that looks pretty even. Let's go guys, let's see how this goes. Sorry for the camera shake, but first time doing a pocket tea, Fruit de Lune from Walmart. Don't know how this is going to be. Got a 15 second press at 3.30. But like Mr. Like Mr. Uh, Mike T said, he an overpresser. So am I, because I want my stuff to stick. So I let it stay for an extra five seconds. Bring you guys in closer to see this now. Feel that heat coming off it? Let's see how this peels off. Ain't too bad. Came right off. Right on to there. Let's get in closer. See how this is. Ain't too bad, guys. Now what I like to do. My bad guys got a got roommates and they're watching this so I had to cut the video out. But we're back here showing you guys what's going on. That's the pocket. Need to lift it up. Kind of see it. It's missing the eyes. But uh ain't too bad. So I actually did it. Let me throw this on and I'll show you guys what it looks like. Alright guys, check it out. You know if you guys can see me. Don't know if the camera angle is good. Not, nah, let me know in the comments. That's the video, hope you enjoyed. That's the design. Don't know if y'all can see, but it ain't too bad. Coming on the shirt, ain't coming off from a little bit of rubs. But if you like what I'm doing, like, subscribe, keep on watching. Shout out to the squad again. Y'all the reason why I keep moving. Let's do this.